so I was just shooting a video, another video and I popped open the trunk to get something out and this happened. Opening the door card here you can see uh, it's a locking mechanism you have to push the tap down and pull this coupler out and then there are two M8 bolts one on this side of the lock and one on this side and you can pull the lock out so I'm gonna pull the lock out and then we'll see what happens so we have pulled the bolts out now we have to pull the lock out So here is our lock. So we'll try to open this thing although it's not designed but we'll still try. A locking tab on this side to open this plastic cover and one on this side as well. So, so we have pulled off both the covers. Now the lock is pretty much naked. Now we have to bend this thing out a little so that we can open the mechanism let me tell you this thing is not designed as a serviceable part we may need to change it in the end so keep that in mind so I've pulled both the tab backwards so that we can lift the actuator part out which opens the trunk for us so as we can see there's one spring which is dislocated from its place so that may be the cause of why we are experiencing this thing let me just have a look and get back so i may have found the problem this part has broken ideally it should have a back cover covered from the back side sorry you can see it now but as you can see i have a piece lying here so the back side broke off and this thing got disconnected from this shaft it was supposed to be like this lock and unlock motion so maybe we can use super glue to stick these two parts again and it will work yeah only time will tell so yes we have found the culprit so one point of the spring is this one down here another one is on this side so we are going to stick this Kind of a bracket with that shaft which locks the actual uh, boot lid and then yeah we are going to clean those things first because they have a lot of oil on top and then we are going to use a super glue to see that our repair can work and how long it will hold before changing the lock again so i have completely cleaned the shaft this plastic bracket cover from inside and that little piece i'm just trying to patch it over so at least it can give a little support so i'll firstly stick this piece back on here and then insert this thing on the shaft again with the help of super glue obviously and we'll see what happens so successfully glue this thing back on now it's the turn to glue that thing on your shaft Gluing mission successful. Hope it can stand the pressure. So as I've told you, we have fixed it. So locking is the mechanical part. And unlocking is actually done by a motor. Open. We just push this thing backwards. So we may have fixed this thing. We just have to keep in mind that there are a pair of contacts which is which tell the BCM the boot is open or not these two are going to ride upon this surface so if you feel any interruptions don't push it into the place gently slide them into their respective positions and the best way to assemble the lock is in when the lock is in the locked position so that the pins we can ensure that the pins are not bending so completely assembled the lock back on just in case if someone wants a part number the part number is 
सिक्स आर ओ एट टू सेवन फाइव ओ फाइव बी सो द ओनली थिंग रिमेनिंग इज टू बोल्ट इट ऑन प्लेस द डोर कार्ड बैक ऑन एंड टेस्ट इट सो एम जस्ट गो डू द फर्स्ट टू थिंग्स ऑन माई ओन एंड शो यू डायरेक्टली द टेस्टिंग so this lock will not work because what i repaired was broken but what i totally didn't pay attention towards is one thing more is broken you can see that shaft it has a crack at the bottom it's separated so it doesn't matter that's why we are hearing clicks you can now see the screw portion of the shaft is getting twisted it's set it down so that's the reason so there's no point of repairing it now because that shaft may not be able to get repaired